freedom. Really, freedom. Yeah, I wanted to be funny as we started this video because in this video, I wanna talk about the importance of heart healthy diet to you, for you, and why it will give you all of the freedom you can imagine. Without further ado, I'm Leslie Urbis. I'm a registered dietitian and a personal trainer who has 12 plus years of experience who helps people to use mindset dieting in order to reduce weight, remove emotional eating tethers, and to reduce disease-inducing patterns like that heart health so you can live free lives without a diet in the body you love, loving every aspect of your life. So without further ado, let's jump in to the top four things you need to do to have a good heart healthy diet. Numero one or number one is most important is to eat whole grains. Now, what I mean by this is that I want the food to be 100% whole. How do you judge this? If you were to go grab some sort of grain right now, that could be bread, cereal, rice, pasta. There's three things I want you to look for. And the first thing is that the number one ingredient says whole something. Could say whole wheat, whole rye, whole barley, whole grain, whole oat, whole whatever, but I want it to say whole. The second thing I want it to do is to have three grams of fiber or more. So go up above the ingredients and look for the number of grams of dietary fiber. If this number is three or more, you're in check. And the last thing I want it to do is somewhere on that label, front, back, side, wherever, I want it to tell you that it has at least 16 grams of whole grain or more. If it has at least two of those three qualities, you have a good whole grain. Whole grains are very beneficial to your heart. They're very beneficial to your gut, which is your second brain. So as we increase our whole grains, we allow ourselves to live more free and stop the low carb junk that we tell ourselves we need to do. The second thing we need to do for heart health is to incorporate good heart healthy fats. And what this means are foods that are high in monounsaturated fats. Things like olive oil, canola oil, peanut oil, avocado, nuts, seeds, things of that nature have a very high amount of what we call monounsaturated fat, which helps to improve our heart health by decreasing the bad cholesterol, increasing the good cholesterol, and giving our healthy bodies fat we need to not only improve our heart health, but to make our skin and our hair and our nails just look better. Now, the third piece to heart health is to include a lot of good antioxidants. In the next couple of months, you're gonna see a lot of antioxidant information from me, so stay tuned. Make sure you go ahead and hit subscribe right now so you can get notified of when those videos come out. But good antioxidant foods like fresh leafy greens, lots of healthy fruits and vegetables, brightly colored foods, the colors of the rainbow, eat the black foods and the blue foods and the red foods and the green foods and the orange foods and the white foods like broccoli and cauliflower. Incorporating those in your body will help you to get the good vitamins and minerals, which keeps your heart functioning and pumping so that way you can get the good things you need to improve your heart healthy diet. The last thing that you need to do to improve your heart health is to improve your portion control. Yes, I do want you to focus on those lean, healthy meats, but we also need to note that in this portion control of, you know, making sure you're doing well with your lean meats and those good fats and all of that good stuff, what I really want you to do is stay up on how much that portion is because if you eat too much of anything, it can always go the opposite direction. So learn what portions are good for you. If you don't know, again, join me in the free Facebook group, Weight Loss and Wellbeing for High Performers to get some of that information, but also really focus on things like learning 
what is good for you and learning those lean meats, etc. If you don't know what those are, I know that way back when I started this channel, you'll see like what's a good protein, what's a carb, what's a fat. Please feel free to scroll back in my videos and find those and get all of that good information, which will be very helpful for you. But remember those things, incorporate the whole grains, eat those good fruits and vegetables, incorporate good heart healthy fat and portion control, especially when it comes to those lean meats, which are great for you, but when overdone could go the wrong way. If you'd like more information about this, please note I'm running a heart healthy class that is free. So click the link below so you can watch that video and learn what you need to improve your heart health. All right, guys, I will catch you in the next episode. As always, like, share, and subscribe so others can get help just like you.